We do our best to find the top plays from each week, but I think we have a first. This is the week that all three plays were made on special teams, all three scoring in different ways. We start with our first nominee, the O'Connor Panthers. Kyler Goodman comes flying in to block the field goal. It's Ashton Capitano who comes up with it, and he is headed the other way for six points. A huge play for the Panthers, and they needed every point to beat Harlan in overtime last night. 30 to 27. Our second nominee also comes from Saturday night's games. It's the opening kickoff from the Holmes Madison game and it's Madison wide receiver Nevin Cooper making it look easy following his blockers and taking the opening kickoff back for six. That set the tone for Madison as they went on to beat Holmes 28 to 16. Finally, this one comes from Friday's Harlandale game. The Indians playing their first game of the season. Thomas Howell with the finger on the punt gets a tip on it and then it's Saxon Langenberg scooping it up and going the other way to score for the Indians. They put up some points in the first game back, a 32-7 win and a Play of the Week nominee. So which special teams play deserves to be our Play of the Week this week? Is it the O'Connor duo of Kyler Goodman and Ashton Capitano, Madison's Nevin Cooper and his opening return kickoff, or Harlandale Saxon Langenberg and his punt return. Voting is open right now at news4sanantonio.com. It will be open until Wednesday, and then we'll announce the winner between these three nominees Thursday evening right here on News 4. Don?